first, the royal wedding. And if you missed it, don't worry, this will bring you up to date. Harry, Megan, dress, mum, grandma, page boy, bridesmaid, bishop, hat, <laughs> Zara, Elton, ex, Clooney's choir, chair, kiss, crowds, carriage, party. <laughs> And we'll be talking more about the wedding later in the show. <laughs> the banking scandals roll on and in the firing line this week, the Dolomites. The Commonwealth Bank has apologised following revelations thousands of children's accounts were used in a staff scam. The bank confirmed staff deposited small amounts of money into youth saver accounts to make them appear active so employees would gain financial incentives. Fraudulently putting money into kids' accounts. Listen up, Dolomites. I don't know how it works on your planet, but here on Earth, banks take children's money, yeah? <laughs> Get it right. But you know what disappoints me the most about all this? According to ComBank, this is Scam Awareness Week. <laughs> I'm starting to think a week's not going to cut it. <laughs> hey, some of those missing athletes have turned up. You know the ones. The Gold Coast Commonwealth mm. Games are well and truly over, but... A whole lot of athletes and officials don't want to go home. More than 200 have applied for protection visas. We aren't going to tolerate people that come here on visas that have been issued in good faith and then take advantage of our system. So, are the Gold Coast athletes genuine refugees? Well, I reckon if you walk down the main street of surfers on a Saturday night and feel safer there than in your home country, yeah, you've seen some shit. <laughs> The head of security at Parliament House had to face the Senate this week. Senators have quizzed the officials who run Parliament House about what was called a white powder incident in this building late last year. Their manager tested the powder by actually tasting it. Senator, I made... The only question in my mind is whether that substance was salt or sugar. Yeah, the... <laughs> The only question in my mind was, why are you testing strange powders with your mouth? <laughs> but that is not the only thing we learned about Graham. Have you ever said, I'll burn this security division to the ground and start again? No, I can't recall making that statement. But you might have said. But I might have. It sounds like something you might have said. Yeah, I might have said that, but to be fair, I have tested a lot of powders. <laughs> Classic Graham. And in the wake of yet another mass school shooting in America, it's clear what the problem is. Not guns. Many of these young boys have been on Ritalin since they were in kindergarten. Now, I am certainly not a doctor, I'm a Marine. So the Marine, who's not a doctor, says it's Ritalin. Any other ideas? And what I mean by that is there are too many entrances and too many exits. Maybe we need to look at limiting the entrance and the exits into our schools. Yes, that's the problem. Too many doors. <laughs>